Hello everyone. I welcome you to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to create ebook like this for absolutely free. So, let's begin. Now to create this type of ebook for free, I am going to recommend you a website called Crelo. So for that just you know simply type C R E L L O Crelo, then simply click on enter. And here you will be seeing that this crelo.com is basically our first search result. So just you know simply click on that. And now you will be seeing that this Crelo website has been you know rightly open. In here you need to you know sign up. So for that just simply click on sign up. And here you need to give your email address. So I will be giving our email address as geeky uh, script at the rate uh, outlook.com. So this is going to be you know our email ID. And then you know I will be giving a password and I will then sign up and I will be coming back once when his sign up is done. Yeah. So welcome back. After creating an account, you know they are going to send an email to your email address for verification of your email ID. And then you know just simply verify that and then just simply uh, login into this uh, uh, Crelo account. And now just you know scroll down a bit and here you will be seeing that this design your story for. Under this you will be seeing that there are so many options. So here we are going to find ebook. So for that I am just going to you know click on this uh, image slider. Uh, then I am going to again click on image slider and here you will be seeing that this ebook option. So now just you know simply click on that. And here you'll be seeing that your, a new tab has been you know rightly opened over here, telling that this is going to be you know our ebook. So you, you can get your title over here. You can just simply change that title to Python. So our book name is Python. And here in the left side you'll be seeing that there are so many templates, right? So they basically gave some templates to build you know your book. So here I'm going to search technology if you just search technology you'll be seeing that this option that is is learning the C++ programming language you will get so many other tech other templates like wireless technologies and other you know uh, templates you can use any templates as for your wish I am going to select the first one that is this learning the C++ language now just you know uh, I have just simply clicking that now just you know after clicking that they basically give some other pages so here we are going to you know first click on this first page you know so that we can get our you know front page of our book. So here as you can see that this font page has been you know rightly imported in our page. You can you know easily edit this page so for that you know just simply double click on it and now just you know simply delete and then uh, write a uh, python. And now just you know I am going to you know just simply uh, scale down a bit you can you know always uh, uh, change these uh, letter spacing to a bit uh, i'm going to you know letter space to 20 so that you know it look nice you can change this uh, author name to as per your wish i am going to you know change this author name to geeky script so that's pretty much about our first page so i have got a book title then author name and i have also got a good backdrop in of as a font page then what we are going to do is we are going to cre uh, create a new page so for that just simply click on this new page and here you'll be seeing that there is this theme called this and here you'll be seeing that there is this new page so just you know simply click on that and here you'll be seeing that this page has been you know rightly imported over here you can always change this uh, to uh, as per your wish and now as you can see this uh, page has been you know rightly edited you can always click on this plus icon to you know maximize it and you can check that you can just simply minimize it and now that you know you have second page has been rightly created and now just simply click on new page and now uh, what we are going to do is we are going to you know create a new contents page right but here in this template you can see that there is no contents page so for that just simply click on this back button and here 
just simply delete everything and then just simply type contents and here we'll be getting this template called mom dad and me so just simply click on that and here we'll be getting that this contents so what we are going to do is we are going to you know simply import that contents over here so just simply click on that and here we'll be getting that this contents has been you know rightly imported over here but the theme that we are doing is this blue color right but here this pink color is not suited right so for that we need to change this color to this color so for that to know what's the color what is the exact hex code of this color just simply click on that and then just simply click on this icon fill icon and here you'll be getting this hex code so just you know simply select this and just and then just simply right click on it and then copy and then again I go to your third page that is where this contains line so you know again just simply click on that and then again go to this fill color to you know change this color to the hex color that that you have just you know let us copy now just you know simply cl uh, click on that and then just simply paste and now just select uh, anywhere and you're getting that this color has been you know rightly changed but this uh, font color is black which you know we want to also change that so you know just simply click on that and then just simply go to this fill and then simply click on this white so that you know this font color has been you know rightly changed to white then again you can uh, just simply click on that so that uh, this page color get changed to white and now uh, you can see that this font color has been you know rightly changed over here right but this image is not appropriate right so we need to change that image as well right so for that just simply uh, select on this image and then uh, simply click on this delete button so that you know it gets deleted but you need to give a uh, nice image right so for that just simply uh, uh, click on a new tab and here just simply type python program then enter and then I simply go to this image tab and here I am going to show you a nice trick so that you can use some image from here for commercial purpose so for that just you know simply click on tool so here you'll be seeing that this uh, uses rights so so just simply click on this uh, drop down and here you'll be getting this creative common license and this commercial and other license so we am going to click on this uh, commercial and other li other license so that you know we can use any image from here for you know our website and we can always use that for commercial purpose as well and here if you just scroll down a bit you will be getting this image so we are going to use this image so for that just simply right click on it and then open new image in new tab and we seeing that this image has been rightly opened over here so just you know simply right click on it and then save image and now just you know simply download that image and then again go back to your Trello tab and here just simply cancel this and again uh, just go to this my files you'll be seeing this option here you'll be getting this button called upload image or video so just you know simply click on that and then you'll be seeing that this window has been opened so we are going to uh, go to this download directory where you know uh, we have this downloaded image that we have latestly downloaded so just you know simply double click on it and here you'll be seeing that this image has been you know rightly uploaded so it's now currently uploading so it's not shown here right now but now as you can see that this image has been you know rightly shown over here so just you know simply click on that to import your image and now as you can see this image has been you know, rightly imported over here so here what we are going to do is you just you know simply drop it over here and then just simply you know maximize it up to our requirements so it's looking nice so it's looking nice and clear over here beautiful isn't it now just you know uh, we are going to uh, uh, create a new page so for that just simply click on this new page here we are going to you know create our first chapter so for that again i go to back and go back to your templates and then again go back and here you can again type uh, technology here i am going to use this artificial intelligence templates 
Here, if you just simply click on this chapter, you'll be getting that this chapter has been you know, rightly designed and all. Here, I like this chapter, so just I just imported that chapter. You can select any template as per your wish. So I have you know rightly imported this chapter, but uh, this image is not suited, right? So just for that, just simply you know select that image and simply click on delete. And then again, I'm going to show you an another website where you can get uh, free images for that that you can use for commercial purpose. So for that, just open a new tab and and in here just simply type Pixabay, then enter. And then you'll be seeing that this Pixabay.com has been you know rightly opened over here. So just you know simply click on that. And here, as you can see, that the Pixabay website has been you know rightly opened. Here, if you just simply programming then enter you'll be seeing this search result now i like this image so just simply click on that and now just you know simply uh, click on download for download then again download you don't need to sign up you just you know verify that you are not a robot now just you know simply click on download and then you'll be seeing that this image has been rightly downloaded you again go back to your uh, Crelo app and then again I go to this uh, my file then again click on this import image or video and then just simply double click on it so that you know this image gets uploaded over here so now as you can see this image has been uh, rightly uploaded over here just you know just simply maximize it as per your wish so I think it's pretty much good over here now just you know you need to change this chapter name to Python introduction that is going to be on our first chapter and here they uh, you can change this footer to introduction to python you can also change this page number to as per your wish so i am going to say this page number as one you can create several pages so for that just simply click on this new page and then you can uh, again uh, go back to your uh, templates and then you can uh, choose a template from here I'm going to choose this template. I don't need these expect expectations, so just you know, simply uh, click on and simply delete, and then just simply uh, click on this text area and then just you know, simply widen a bit so that you know it look very nice. And now that you can see that this page has been you know rightly imported over here, you can always edit this page as per your wish. So, so this is basically you know our first chapter, first page, then uh, second page. You know if you want to create a chapter two, so for that you know just simply you can uh, simply click on this uh, triple dot, then uh, simply cl uh, click on this duplicate to create a new chapter, similar to this chapter one. And there can you can always uh, drag and replace your as per your page number, so that you can see that this chapter one is is rightly over here, then this chapter one's first page, and then this chapter you can always edit this to you know chapter 2 yeah and you can change this to let's say variables and all so in this way you can you know easily edit your book and you can easily download by you know simply clicking on this download button and then you'll be seeing this page where you know it's telling that all pages or you want to select a range of pages so for which you know i'm going to uh, download all pages so just simply click on all pages and then download and then you know it will say that preparing your download for design it will take some time maybe a minute or two so uh, it is basically you know going to prepare your download and now as you can see this ebook has been you know rightly downloaded over here just you know simply minimize it and then again go to your uh, download directory and here as you can see this python has been you know rightly downloaded over here you can uh, again just you know simply right click and then open with chrome and, and you can see that this ebook has been you know rightly opened over here so this is basically your ebook i have shown you how to create this type of ebook for free you can uh, create uh, five ebook per month from this crelo website so as you can see i have downloaded one book so i have i have you know uh, four out of five ebook downloaded left for this month 
So this is a very good website to create an ebook. So that's pretty much all about it. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like this video, then please give it a like and also do share with your friends. 